I have been known to brag that if it has strings in a bow, I'll play it. So when I discovered there was an instrument that had strings in a bow that I didn't know what it was, I, I had to get one. And, and it just happens to be a Hindi instrument. And then this challenge came up. <laughs> so I was very happy. <laughs> it gave me a reason to practice. So I'm going to introduce you to my new instrument. They just appear around the house. Yeah, that's right. How many instruments does a musician need? Just one more. All of them. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> just one more. The answer is always just one. So this is just because I'll probably get nervous and forget the words or something. Learning a new instrument for your challenge, Baraha. That's right. <laughs> How is that for complimentary? Speak Hindi. Yeah, I know. Yes. How bad can he be? Because I've never heard this. No, he, he hasn't practiced, so he doesn't know what I'm doing. So that's kind of bad. It's in 16. Look, isn't it cool? <laughs> what is it? Well, I've been calling it, basically introducing it, and it has um, four strings on, on top of all the nice sitar like frets. And then it's got a bunch of all these extra keys, and those are sympathetic vibrating strings, they go underneath the frets, you tune them and then you forget about them and they just vibrate and hum so they can oh, amplify. It's an Indian hurdy-gurdy. <laughs> <laughs> or, or an Indian hardanger, if you will. Or, or, yeah, so, so anyway, here it is. And uh, it's really cool. Yeah, it and so I am um, going to play a raga. I'm going to play a, a, a modified version of rag yaman, which I've been told is both the first and the last raga you should learn. And, uh, and the verses are, are um, borrowed. Some people posted some nice things. So the first verse is by uh, Rosalind Yahan. And the second verse is by Brendan. Is he here? Borrowing it? Okay, and I did the third verse. So, um, and it's in Tintal, which means it's in 16. I have to tell the drummer this. <laughs> right, so, but it's really like four measures of four. Okay. The emphasis is on one, except the third measure where you don't play on one. <laughs> so, one, two, three, four. Two, two, three, four. Two, three, four, and four. Two, three, four. However, I'm going to attempt to do a little a, a lap first, which is like an un rhythmic introduction because a raga should have one of those before it starts into the rhythmic section. So I'll just nod my head and hopefully, <laughs> hopefully it'll work or something or like quietly clap to keep the rhythm along with me once I get to the rhythmic part. So we will see how this goes. But one, two, three, four. I'm not going any faster than that because I gotta get words out too. Here's your thank you token in advance. Thank you for helping. <laughs>